All right, guys, it's been a while for a Flashy Friday. So here we go, Flashy Friday. Super flashy. Baja designs all around. I wired my reverse lights too to make it strobe. Hey guys, my name is Robert. If you haven't been here before, please check out my videos. The things that I talk about here are DIYs, product reviews, family vlogs, and lastly I talk about cars and trucks, especially this truck behind me, which is my 2017 Toyota Tacoma, which I have coined Heart Shell Taco. So on my Instagram, I had my Baja Design Lights do a super flash, like an emergency car, and people were asking me, Rob, you know, how did you do this? So I just want to show you how that happened. So All right, so the first thing you got to have is a Switch Pro unit. Uh, I know S-Pod actually does it as well, but uh, I'm only familiar with Switch Pros. So uh, this is an SDHQ bracket uh, mount for the taco and I have it flush mounted on here. Uh, this is the controllers from my lighting. The brain is actually underneath the hood. So that's the first thing you need to get. So uh, these are not cheap, but I'll go ahead and show you uh, where you can get it through Amazon. Just see, let's go ahead and log on. Yeah. So this is an Android system. Yeah, this is Android. So go ahead and log. Yeah. That's an airplane. Ooh. Ooh, yeah. Airplane. You got it? Yeah. Alright, so now we're gonna go to uh, settings. The settings. You gotta wait. Yeah, it's loading. Yes. Yeah, I don't know, dog. And then config switches. Now it's loading again. I'm gonna go to next. Scroll down. Next. So scroll down. Next. So I had flash, but I like strobe. So this is where it's important. But I did the different strobes so that way the um <laughs> So that way the uh that way the output would vary on them. So basically, if you were to change it, say I had this one, SWH, which I don't have a button, I can push it so it's constant burst burst strobe, constant touch strobe or burst strobe. So touch would mean you'd have to keep on holding it to do that. Otherwise, you could just double click it. Let's go ahead and exit this. So once you exit it, it saves your settings and you're all set. So now what we can do is uh, go ahead and just double tap the switch here. Yep, so when you double tap the switch, you can see that it starts again to flashy mode. Then Jesse's doing them all. Yeah, that's flashy. So I don't know if you can see me on this. Let me get out the way here. But that's how you make flashy mode on the truck. Uh, I got my Joanna really jumping around, so I apologize for that. But um, that's what I got to do. I got to make videos whenever I got time. So I want to say thanks for watching. If you have any other questions, let me know. Post below. I'll put more details how switch poles get wired and everything in the future and the rest of the lights. But I just want to go over how to do the flash. Peace out.